Hello everybody, in this video, I am going to give an update on my portfolio. Right now my portfolio is worth $98,416.69. In the past year, I am up $24,433.07. Year to date for the year 2024, I am currently up $8,026.23. Today was a red day for me. I lost over $3,000 during the day. I lost $3,046.13 during the day. After hours, I am up $455.03. Let's go over my positions. For my options, I'm selling Amazon $190 covered calls. These expired June 21st. My total return, I am down $48. I'm selling Disney $115 covered calls. These expire June 21st. My total return $24. I'm selling PayPal $65 covered calls. These expire June 21st. My total return $712. I'm selling Verizon $39 covered calls. These expire June 21st. My total return $156. I'm selling LUV $28 covered calls. These expire July 5th. My total return, I am down $410. I'm selling Google $180 covered calls. These expire July 19. My total return, $249. I'm selling Robinhood $18 covered calls. These expire July 19. My total return, I am down $1,130. I'm selling Starbucks $80 covered calls. These expire July 19. My total return, $292. I'm selling SoFi $8 covered calls. These expire July 19. My total return, $186. For my stocks, I have 300 shares of Amazon. Amazon is at $183.97. My average cost, $98.95. My total return, $25,509.83. I have 6,000 shares of SoFi. SoFi is at $6.81. My average cost, $5.62. My total return, $7,120.80. I have 300 shares of Disney. Disney is at $100.04. My average cost, $60. My total return, $12,012. I have 1,000 shares of Robinhood. Robinhood is at $23.35. My average cost, $17.53. My total return, $5,825. I have 500 shares of Southwest Airlines. Southwest Airlines is at $28.40. My average cost, $28.03. My total return, $185. I have 100 shares of Google. Google's at $175.47. My average cost, $142.48. My total return, $3,299. I have 200 shares of PayPal. PayPal is at $61.69. .69.
My average cost, $57.70. My total return, $798. I have 200 shares of Verizon. Verizon is at $39.76. My average cost, $39.31. My total return, $90.10. I have 200 shares of Starbucks. Starbucks is at $80.17. My average cost, $78.15. My total return, $404.50 This is a margin account. My margin total is $114,007.96. My margin used is $111,058.44, which leaves me with $2,949.52 in buying power. My margin status is low risk. My buffer is $44,630.39. This is how much money I can lose before I get margin called. My annual interest rate is 6.25%. The daily interest that I'm paying is $18.93. And I am borrowing $2,000 interest free. So it's happened again and this has happened so many times. I hit 100k and then immediately after I go down a couple thousand dollars it's over and over again it's been unable to hold steady above 100k I think it held for like one day yesterday but geez every other time um yeah today lost a lot of money over three thousand dollars during the day real sad um I didn't change anything I didn't change anything in my portfolio. I know I keep saying that I might put in order to change my hood covered calls. Now the thing is, I actually did try to put in an order to do that, to change it to $20 strike price. However, I don't have enough buying power to do that. I only have, um, you know, $2,949.52 in buying power. However, this is including margin. However, if I want to roll it out to you know, the $20 strike price, I don't have enough like actual cash to do that. So Robinhood wouldn't let me. I tried to put the order in. Robinhood said I did not have enough, you know, cash to do that. So, oh well. But everything else, it's the same. I haven't changed anything. I haven't bought anything new. I haven't sold anything. So everything's still the same as last time. If I do change anything, I'll let you guys know. But for now, I'm just sitting back and waiting. And I guess I'm losing, you know, several thousand dollars today. Oh my goodness. But I think overall in the long term, I'm going to go back up above 100K eventually again. Um, but for now, I'm back down to 98K again. Oh well. All right, that's pretty much it for this portfolio update. I will be making more updates like this in the future. So if you guys want to see more videos like this, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.